Good morning, church. Lord, bless every precious soul here, those that are on their way, those that can't make it for whatever reason, those that are on Zoom, and um, those that are just out homeless in the street, Lord, just send somebody to provide them with blankets, food, water, whatever they need, in the name of Jesus. Um. Edification time. I was, I'm like you, most of you. Um, the world is hitting us with so much uh, trouble and rules and uh, mandates and all of these things. And um, we get anxious sometimes. We get uh, stressed out. Um, every time I go to work, at least once a week, they're changing our, our clock in, you know, when we sign in to get paid. And that's kind of stressful because if you don't get it right, you don't get paid. And um, I'm figuring out, I'm trying to figure it out on my own, uh, trying to find somebody I can ask to help me. And I forgot and that I need to trust in God. And the very uh, scripture I was going to share with y'all is right here on the on the handouts we got today, and uh, so that's further confirmation. Right. Plus, I have um, I got two more uh, verses in the New Testament to share with y'all. But um, trust in the Lord, Proverbs three five and six. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and lean not to your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge Him, and He shall direct your path. And um. I was trusting in myself, uh, trusting in money, trusting in the bank that uh, they will get my funds right, and I was trusting in all the wrong things. And uh, I know y'all don't do that, but that's that's me, and uh, that's my issue. So uh, when we were praying. Um, it was in Jessica's prayer also to trust in the Lord. And and I said, wow. So I was going to switch and, and come with something else. But I said, no, I'll go ahead and do that anyway, because that's what the uh, Lord put on my heart. And I'm supposed to trust in him. The same, I think sometimes that the problems that I'm dealing with uh, are too big for God. And of course, that's stupid. Nothing's too big for God. And uh he can handle it all. The same God that uh, uh, bless us with the finances so that we can pay tithes and offerings. Uh, I had four strokes and I'm still alive. And the same God that, that took me through that, uh, Janet had to sit there and watch me have a tube go down my uh, nose into my stomach so they could feed me. Um, uh, I started losing my sight. Uh, couldn't walk. And uh, have to be carried to the bathroom and all that. I, I started losing hope, you know. And uh, God uh, healed me and blessed me anyway. And, you know, in spite of myself. And the other scriptures I want to share with y'all. is in Philippians. Not Corinthians, Philippians. Um... Fourth chapter, the uh, sixth and seventh verse. Okay, six. Be anxious for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your requests be known to God. And the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. And that's what I need to do. I believe that's what we all need to do. And I was really uh, uh, encouraged by the uh, praise and worship songs we did today. Uh, they, uh, I sat there and um, I teared up because I was 
I felt I was disappointing God for not believing in him and trusting in him. And he saw me through all this, you know, through prison, uh, through crack, smoked crack 23 years, and God delivered me from that. And uh, I've been to five different programs, and they couldn't help me at all, you know. And so um, I got to remember the same God that did everything for me up through the past. He let me meet Janet and uh, uh, my wonderful wife. And uh, she puts up with me, you know, and uh, only God can do that, <laughs> you know. So um, uh, I was sitting here. If Mike Tyson broke into the house and grabbed Janet by the hair and kicked the dog, uh, I'd really have to pray because uh, <laughs> what could I do? <laughs> I'd probably get a stick or something. But trusting in God, um, uh, things like that don't happen to me. So I'm thankful for that. And uh, with that, I'm going to uh, get down for here before I get to look. I see him giving it to Sister Kim uh, every Sunday, and I'm going to step down before I get it. <laughs> And thank you all for listening. Y'all be encouraged. And God bless you all. <laughs>